across England and Wales at the moment. Scotland and Northern Ireland have seen some sunny spells this morning, but the way the weather looks isn't really what everyone's talking about at the moment, but the way it feels, particularly the really cold wind blasting across us. Take a look at the blue arrow sweeping across the map behind me. You can see where they're coming from, Scandinavia. It's good and cold there, certainly at this time of year. And as the wind picks up in strength, which I think it will do even more so towards the end of this week, the cold feel will stay with us. That cold air has also been feeding in quite a bit of cloud this morning for England and Wales. We've seen a scattering of showers, but Scotland and Northern Ireland have fared slightly better, and I think they will continue to do so through this afternoon. Still more sunny spells to come for Northern Ireland. A little bit more cloud drifting into the south, though. Maybe just the odd light shower here through the second part of the day. Northern and western Scotland keeping some good spells of sunshine, but I think through the central lowlands we could feed in a few showers this afternoon, pushing a fair way west on that stiff easterly wind. Certainly for England and Wales, the cloud is set to stay solid. There's a risk of a few more showers as well, generally easing back across the Midlands, East Anglia and the southeast to the frequency we saw this morning. But I think still a risk this afternoon of one or two persistent or heavy ones for the southwest and Wales this afternoon. A risk of some hail and maybe even some sleet or snow here as the showers go over the higher ground. Five or six degrees, the top temperatures with that easterly wind. Certainly it is going to stay feeling on the cold side outside. And the cold story continues on into tonight. Notice the blue shading spreading out on the map behind me. We are in for a widespread frost. The temperatures that you'll see behind me in just a second are the city temperatures away from the city centres. For most of us, temperatures will be around freezing or even a degree or so below. And look out for a few showers coming into the northeast tonight. That could turn things icy here the first thing tomorrow morning. Certainly, we're starting the day tomorrow on a cold note. And then we're really going to have to keep an eye on this area of rain here as it comes in from the northeast. There's a potential for it to fall as snow for a time to tomorrow morning across eastern Scotland and northern England. Turning increasingly to rain though as it makes its way south during the day but I think we will see it turning a little wintry again in the south tomorrow evening. Another cold day to come as well for all of us. Four, five, six degrees the top temperatures and still that biting easterly wind. It stays cold until the end of the week as well. The chance though that the wind will strengthen up even further in the south on Friday and still a risk of some more persistent showers, maybe even something a little more wintry. Staying cold